making that a little bit less time otherwise I'd love to play the whole video from that but um, it's a decent amount that would take up a decent amount of video um, today I have two things from Zobie I know what they both are but I'm not sure which one is which so I'm going to open one and if it's the one that I want to save for last I'll set it aside and open the other one first before showing what's in the first one so start opening here all right well this worked out it ended up being that item So, first item, JSA certified, of course, is an Alan Harris photograph. It has other cast members in the background, but it's a picture of him as Bosk from Star Wars. See, there's IG-88, Dengar, Boba, and Vader. Also the JSA certification. But yeah, this is pretty cool. I do not have an Alan Harris autograph, nor you know, anything of Bosk anymore up until now. So, or wait, I may have a couple other things, but um, yeah, this is definitely cool. So. I'm excited to add this to my other Star Wars autographs. Item number two is another really, really cool one that I've been waiting for for a while. Almost thought I was going to have to go to the post office to pick it up, but JSA certified. And it also kind of runs with the video I was showing before. Some in the middle US of that is autograph. It's a pretty cool picture. Um, they had a different one, bunch of different ones to choose from. And for me, it was between this, Mighty Ducks, and Maximum Overdrive. But went with Breakfast Club. This is pretty sweet. I was debating about either going between for the Breakfast Club one, this one, or the original movie image from the poster. And I felt this had more of a um, background and whatnot in case they end up getting some more of the cast members to get the other one signed. So... Hint, hint. Sheedy next. But, um, no, this is definitely sweet. I'm really happy to add Emilio Estevez to my list. I do have an autograph from when I met Charlie Sheen, who, if you know, is Emilio Estevez's brother. Because his real name is Carlos Estevez. And him and Martin were the only ones in the family of acting that didn't want to go by their family name Emilio Estevez and their uncle Joe did end up using the last name Estevez so this is sweet I'm really happy to add this to my um let's see I'll have another unboxing coming up soon do I have any forgetting if I have any more pre-orders it might be it for me for now um, you know with like Christmas and stuff coming up I might have to slow down here a little bit so 
Thanks again for watching. Stay tuned for more as usual.